Welcome back everybody to Altcoin Daily. Is now the best time to buy Bitcoin? Let's talk about it. Plus, make sure you watch the entire video. I wanna share with you a major update coming for Ethereum this Wednesday. And of course, some world news in general. The world is slowly integrating cryptocurrency into any and all platforms. Everybody seems to be coming around. So let's talk about what's going on in the world after we talk about is now the best time to buy Bitcoin. If you appreciate our daily content, do me a favor, hit the like button, truly helps us out. And let's start right here. When Bitcoin meets the 200 week moving average, big gains usually follow. Has Bitcoin met the 200 week moving average? Yes, it did. In fact, we're hovering right below it now and have been for a little over a week, as you can see, Every time in the past where Bitcoin either hit it or dipped below it just a little bit, hit it or dipped below it just a little bit, what followed was 120x gains, 4x gains, 15x gains. Additionally, we have another indicator confirming that we are at the bottom or near the bottom, the net unrealized profit loss indicator. The Bitcoin NUPL has entered the pink capitulation phase. I highlighted the prior capitulation phases to show when this has occurred before in Bitcoin's history. Take a look at every other time where the NUPL has entered in the pink capitulation phase. What a fantastic time to buy. Now, sometimes it entered the pink when it was near the bottom, sometimes when it was at the bottom, sometimes when it was after the bottom. But as you can see, actually any time where Bitcoin has entered this pink has been a great, great, great time to buy. Now, it's important to be realistic, right? My goal for this video, it's not financial advice, it's to provide you with context, perspective, insight in the market by showing you actual charts, data, and different stories. So it's important to be realistic. So understand this, Bitcoin is going to need a lot more buy side volume than at present to match buyer follow through volume levels at previous bear market bottoms at the 200 week moving average. We're gonna to need to see a lot more buy volume here. So you can take a look at two prior times where Bitcoin met the 200 week moving average. Actually, you know, again, this is when Bitcoin was $3,000, $4,000, $4,000, $5,000, $6,000 right here. Awesome times to buy. As you can see, we need a lot more buy side volume and it could come with a giant wick in a short amount of time like this, or like if you were around in 2018, we were, and you can go back to some of our videos, Everybody was waiting for a even a greater capitulation. We didn't see that and it grinded. We didn't see that huge buy volume. Instead, it came over many weeks. So either can happen. I appreciate this analyst keeping it real. I'm going to like because I want to support. So taking a look at Bitcoin's entire price history, I understand that just looking at this chart, it seems like all the gains are in the past. All Bitcoin's gains are in the past. To that, I say, think bigger and understand that Bitcoin is doing the same old cycle action it normally does. Yes, there are slight differences this time around, but in the macro picture, we're on track and the next Bitcoin having it's going to be epic. We're right on track, my friends. So is now the best time to buy Bitcoin? For me personally, yes, I'm going hard in Bitcoin here, Ethereum here, a select few altcoins. I think if legendary investor Warren Buffett was into Bitcoin, he would be telling his clients, my friends, there is fear in the air, blood on the streets. Now is the time to buy and maybe start buying over the next couple months. For me, this is the time to buy. For you, you will have to make that decision yourself. But just let's go over some of the things that just happened in the last few days. How can you not be bullish on crypto? Shopify adds NFT gated option for online retailers. Shopify is leaning into NFTs as the future of e-commerce. The online shopping giant, which allows small businesses to create custom e-commerce shops, is launching NFT gated storefronts as a new feature for brands looking to make their stores more exclusive. Shopify announced this Wednesday, I love this video they made in this tweet, token gated experiences ready to give superpowers to your most loyal fans Build an even stronger community around your brand and reward your people by unlocking exclusive shopping experiences. Think limited edition merch, drops, discounts, and much more. Oh, hey, doodles. Watch this. Invite your community into a world that 
recognizes and rewards loyalty. Token holders connect a crypto wallet to unlock exclusive shopping experiences. From early access to drops and limited collections, to one-of-a-kind experiences and other surprises. Start token gating on your Shopify store and unlock the power of your brand's community. In other news, big upgrade for Ethereum's mainnet coming up this Wednesday. Ethereum is to undergo Gray Glacier update. This is what you need to know if you hold Ethereum. Next Wednesday, June 29th, the Ethereum network will undergo a scheduled upgrade called Gray Glacier at block 15,050,000. The Gray Glacier upgrade is prolonging the difficulty bomb by 700,000 blocks equivalent to about 100 days starting Wednesday. The difficulty bomb is to disincentivize miners to stop mining on the current network, ETH Proof of Work, after a successful transition to ETH Proof of Stake. So this is congruent and synonymous with ETH becoming Proof of Stake. Tim Baiko, a core Ethereum developer, says that this will be the last prolongment to the difficulty bomb, implying ETH 2.0, ETH Proof of Stake, is a few months away from launch. He added that this upgrade will keep scammers off the network because it will require decent technical knowledge. If you hold Ethereum, no action is needed for you, for the users or the holders, unless stated by your respective exchanges or wallet service providers, probably not. To be compatible with the Glacier, Gray Glacier upgrade, node operators need to update the client version they run to one of the ones listed here. So proof of stake is coming, bull market, bear market. This will be one of the biggest things to ever happen to crypto. In other news, maybe you heard, I think this is a big deal. Perhaps the best soccer player or a football player in the world, Ronaldo, and Binance, the biggest exchange in the world, announced a multi-year NFT partnership. Cristiano Ronaldo is one of the biggest football players in the world, and he has millions and millions, tens of millions of fans around the world, and he is promoting NFTs, crypto. I'm delighted to announce my partnership with Binance. Together, we are going to change NFT game and take football to the next level. And this is just the beginning. In other news, a string of 200 sleeping Bitcoins from 2010, somebody who mined 200 Bitcoins, they've just been sleeping. This is worth 4.27 million moved on Friday, indicating this is not a dead wallet. This is somebody who has been hodling. Is this a bad thing? No, it's not. This is just how the Bitcoin network works. This guy took the risk early and he held, I can't believe he held or he found his keys, whatever it is, it paid off. And this is how Bitcoin's Gini coefficient, the distribution of Bitcoin becomes better over time. He sells something, buys a house or whatever, and then people buying into Bitcoin at these levels will have more Bitcoin than maybe in several years from now. If you are a Bitcoin believer like me, this is just par for the course, don't worry, but I did want to alert you, this is what's going on. If you use Coinbase, if you use Coinbase Pro, like I do, which is the more trader friendly, the more advanced version of Coinbase, it's the exact same login. Coinbase is actually phasing out its trader friendly Pro exchange. Coinbase Pro is going away. The standalone service will be replaced by Advanced Trade, a feature within the main Coinbase app, I believe, if you use Coinbase, you don't have to do anything. I did want to alert you of this though. eBay snaps up NFT marketplace known origin. One of the first NFT marketplaces known origin has generated almost 8 million since launching in 2018. eBay wants into NFTs, eBay wants into crypto. University of Cincinnati, one of the many collegiate institutions adding crypto courses to curriculum as well as launching two new crypto programs, the Ohio-based university will add a lab space dedicated to cryptocurrency partnerships. Pretty cool. My name is Aaron at Altcoin Daily. Appreciate you for being on our team. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the thumbs up button if you got value. I'll see you tomorrow.